So I actually sat for a couple of minutes here in front of this station and although we bought an upgrade for the sawmill last time, it's clearly not enough because it still cannot keep up with all the work. So I guess we can now buy some more upgrades. Let's take this one. Okay, where should we put it? Yeah, but this will limit the station. Here we cannot put it. Okay, we'll put it here and watch it. Because I've seen one of the trains. Because uh, the ma yeah, this is those of one trains. Um, well, one of those trains. Excuse me. Uh, it couldn't unload everything, so it goes back with some wood, uh, wooden logs left. Now, will this be able to? Yeah, whatever. I guess I'll buy the last. So I will have all the expansions in place, like so. Now I think we might be limited by these trains that are exporting the wooden boards, or not, we shall see. I guess we can fa make it fast. Okay, this took 20. Yeah, this is long. This is like five ticks. So it's the longest. Hmm. Now I think the only thing that we can add na now besides this coal processing, which I don't know, maybe could be a good idea. Uh, we can use this toy shop, but yeah, we don't need really need money. I guess if only we could add that coal, charcoal kiln. If we could add it like this. And then some of the coal will appear. We'll let it run for some time. And build. We have one. Yeah, but this consumes coal. Uh, Baldwin. With some coal wagons. One, two, three. I don't know if it's even worth it. No. If it's worth it to build more. Yeah, but why not, I guess, because otherwise we'll have to add them later, so why bother? Yeah, and I didn't give it waters. Go there. And then go here. And unload. So let's see what will happen. Because this station is definitely overwhelmed by all the wood that we're transporting. So, who knows? Maybe this call will help. In the meantime, we can take a look at our iron production. So, it's definitely getting down. We used to have a larger buffer of iron. Yeah, but then but then these stations cannot keep up with it. Like this one is keeping up. Okay. But this one doesn't. So maybe we'll have to buy some upgrades. And there's not many options, actually. There's just one option outside of this one, which is more uh, complex. Um, yeah, uh, and it's more efficient. It will give you one iron token out of one iron bar, but you have to provide it 
also coal and so this is very efficient but the thing is you already have these three so you could not get rid of them so this will just be like a bonus if there was a way of disabling this standard ones and just use this then yeah so what I'll do I'll put it somewhere here now it should be faster and it should go faster through all this backlog Now we won't deliver anything to that toolworks for now. We don't need it. Let's check a look now. Now it's still struggling. We are still at maximum. Yeah, but that's the thing, we, we cannot do anything at the moment. Um, what we could do? Transport the wood, these logs here, and then make another line. Maybe it's possible, but why, why bother for now? So we'll leave it as it is. We should get a constant increase in uh, wooden tokens. Yeah, I guess it's uh, it's fast enough. In, in the long run, it should uh, should be enough. Um, mm -hmm. So I saw that there's still more iron than coal delivered. So maybe we should build two more trains one for each of these coal mines which i'm gonna do let's see if we have some yeah we could i definitely if it's gonna be low no we're gonna build the trains and then we're gonna uh, add some upgrades if needed okay one two three four and the usual orders go here Then go here and unload. Right. And a second, which will go here. Then we'll go. here and unload okay now for this coal mine uh, is it worth it to buy an upgrade I could easily take yeah this one why not I can afford it, so it will double the output. Just to avoid that a train comes here and, you know, doesn't have enough and goes around. Yeah, it will give us some reward. 100, uh, $1,000 dollars if we deliver 400. If we do what? Yeah, well, not deliver, but actually produce 1,000, um, 400 uh, iron tokens. So when is the next era? 1945. So what we're doing till then, we might as well. Yeah, let's fast forward a little bit and see how this station will go. 
What is of interest for us, it's obviously the call deliveries. That's the thing, in this view you don't even see the, uh, the, the orientation of the signs. So we should soon definitely have more coal delivered because we have two more trains. Also, yeah, that's that's one of the reasons why we get less coal. Uh, not only because we have one less mine, it's because it's 36 versus 48. So it's like one third more poor delivery of uh, uh, iron ore. Now we'll check how our transportation of passengers is doing going. So this 66 but this will take care. 41, no th this is holding, this is holding, everything is great. On this line no need to add uh, more tractors. Oh, excuse me. <laughs> I guess I was playing too much farming simulator. No need to add more trains for now. While this, I would say that is struggling, definitely. As you can see, there's more and more passengers left untransported. Okay. Yeah, definitely we need at least one more train. So, because I can, I'm gonna build right away this expansion. Okay. 31, but it's even... Yeah, there's no point in using this train at all. So I'll take the Baldwin. Now, I don't think I had it on camera, but we have two types of new wagons. Um, so we had the coach car which could ha hold 15 passengers. Now we also have the first class and the second class. The first class is marginally better, but per unit of length it's not better, but it gives you this income bonus, which we don't need now, right? Right now. And then we have the second class, which um, the thing is that you can fit only three of them. Uh, in the size of six. So, yeah. I don't know. Should we? Should we? Well, let's. Hmm. Let's try it out. Just try it out and see if it works. It works. If not, well, if it works, well, I'll upgrade all my trains like this. If it's not work, it not. It doesn't work. Then I won't upgrade my trains. Okay. Let's see the speed. Uh, yeah, well, now it doesn't have a penalty because it's not, it's not full. But once it will take more passengers on board, uh, it might start to have a penalty in speed. Yeah, as you can see, 45 miles an hour as opposed to 47. Yeah, and definitely this little train is not adequate for so many uh, for so many wagons. Yeah, all my passenger trains are very far. <laughs> like, yeah, they go in tandem. As usual. Okay. Now I can call this train to the depot. And also that one. 
And this one has five of those. Okay. We'll lose the passengers, unfortunately. Um, one, two, three, four. I'll start it. Then we'll waiting for train four to come in. Okay. Also delete these wagons and replace them with class two. Now I won't get it out for. Uh, I already pressed the start button because I wanted to leave a buffer between them. But okay, it's gonna wait. So do we have more passenger trains for these lines? We don't actually. So we have we used to have just two, now we have three. No, we have four. This oh there there isn't anyone, so yeah, we have three trains. Now these trains now should do a better job. If not, I'll have to add one more. Um this line is really not struggling for now, so there isn't the point of uh, upgrading my trains. Okay, so now let's check the situation with coal. It's definitely better. Maybe. Oh, I can already collect my... Yeah, okay. Can I refuse it? Just politics, refuse it. This I cannot refuse, okay. So we're definitely producing more iron now to sponsor all our needs. And now I, I can, because I forgot I can add a restaurant ex uh, extent. Well, yeah, that's why I haven't added because it was too expensive timber wise. But I guess now we can afford it if we'll find enough space to place it here. Okay. Extension restaurant. Yeah, here we are more limited. Does it have to? Oh, we can put it this side. Okay, that's better. So this should single-handedly increase our revenues from transporting passengers without adding any new line. Which is great if you have the ka to sponsor this. I guess this one already has it. Yeah, we finished here. We can move to this um, loop, which is bigger. Yeah, I can put it like this if you want. Okay, we're strong. Okay. going through that timber thing so fast. I 
and this should be the last one. And we are almost out of wooden tokens. Uh, yeah, I can put it here. So now we definitely should make more money. There is one upgrade that I could use is that freight station which would have which would uh, have uh, an effect on the loading and unloading of mail but what does it cost uh, oh just a yeah, more wooden wooden tokens uh, it's okay for now Wow, it's taking a lot of time to finish loading. So again, we are capped by... Find your locomotive. Okay, OGM. Find the... Okay, okay, okay. So if you buy this locomotive, they'll give us... No, I don't need it. So as I was saying, we're still limited by the timber tokens. Oh, I... We have 128? Yeah, but we don't have the upgrade. Silly me. Okay. Yeah. So I bought, you know, I started that train transporting coal, but I forgot to add uh, the upgrade that was making this possible. Now we shall see if our wooden boards trains can keep up. Because definitely our production increased and now our wood logs is going down. And I'm waiting for the coal train, I would like to see it coming and unloading. Here it is. Um, yeah, it cannot keep keep up with all the coal, but yeah, that, that's. I think this was actually the intention with these upgrades. You do an upgrade of coal here, another upgrade of coal there, and yeah, by the magic, you know, you have increased your timber. Oh, yeah, we definitely need one more train, at least one more train, to carry more wooden boards. Hmm, hmm. One, two, three, four. I think we're doing five. Hmm. 
So I'm thinking, uh, is it worth it to add another, either another station, you know, as a, a, for, a fourth road, um, a fourth row, I wanted to say, or make an entire separate station or maybe separate the trains. Hmm. Still, my trains cannot keep up with all the wooden boards. I can always add one more train, but you know, this traffic can, can be, you know, can be clogged and eventually. Oh no. Yes. Yeah, and we already kept at 300. <sighs> yeah, but does the game waste this resources in the sense that if we are kept at 300, will it consume more logs? I think yes. So we are basically losing lots of logs now. Yeah. We're losing all the access that we cannot transport. Unfortunately, I will add one more. I have no other option. One, two, three, four, five, and copy the orders. Can this keep up? Ugh, barely. So now the rate is four to three. The upgrade will be worse. It will be five to three. Yeah, but it's holding, I would say, it's still holding. We can buy the freight station extension to make it unload faster, A, and having a larger buffer, buffer B. So as you can see, this station is already at zero. So we're now consuming only from this station. is sufficient for our needs. I really wish I could upgrade my trains to something more powerful, but it seems that at the moment I don't have choice. Uh, the only thing I could do is like have another separate separate line of coal tokens production oh ah okay okay hmm 
So I have a single train transporting, right? Which is not that great. This is keeping up. Maybe I should add a second train. Hold in. One, two, three, four. And copy the orders of this. Here, maybe at this extension. Okay, as for this. Okay, I have this option, so I could add another train for that line also. One, two, three, four. And copy orders from a train from this line. Like this. Hmm. Yeah, I'm afraid we could overwhelm this station because there is not other any other upgrade that can process uh, coal faster. But it's still not over overwhelmed so we should uh, monitor it for some time so as i was saying if i were to replace all my track uh, trains and i have it says 51 but one is that unique type one uh, so 50 trains, if I were to replace them with these more powerful, like the Russian, the class 65, these will consume coal instead of money. So this would mean that we'll, we'll need to have very powerful, uh, a lot extensive, I would say, network of coal token production. This will not be nearly enough. I would have to have a second one. And it requires what? It requires a tool factory, right? So I would have to take this or because here we have two coals. But do we have any more tool factories? I don't see them. Yeah, like here we have. Uh, we can transport from this two or this one. Yeah, what I, which I would like to avoid. And and I'm hoping in the next era we'll have. Oh, and I can pay to go for the next era, right? Yeah, why wait? Okay, we are in the next era and. We have unlocked another resource, which is this uh, oil tokens, which are not built directly. You have to extract oil, okay, then deliver it to one of these refineries, okay, and then transport the oil from the ref oh, not the oil the yeah, this is oil and this is fuel, I guess. It's called fuel. I think. Yeah, it does it says anywhere. So to transport, cr it's crude oil. Okay, that's crude oil. So you'd have to transport it to a factory. And then in a factory, you can make goods from timber, ports, make goods, or from that fuel, you make goods and, and these tokens. Now I noticed that this is already, you know, 
now struggling. So I'd have to necessarily buy this upgrade before it's too late. Yeah, as you can see, my trains are going back with some of the some of the uh, timber, which is not good because now this is maxed out. Great. And I'm losing. I know why. Why? Why is it actually losing? It should stop. Like, like if my output is filled, it's fill up. Why it continues to process? It should stop. Should I buy the storage, or shouldn't I? Now, I guess the most interesting question for now would be to find out if we have some new trains. Uh, we have. Uh, we had this, so it's not new. So we have this one, which consumes tons of money, and it's not really powerful. And we have these two new ones. Uh, it's a little bit disappointing. I was expecting for more, to be honest. Now this is 600 HP, which is great, but it consumes these tokens, which we don't have any. And it's quite expensive, look at it. So I guess we will have to continue using Baldwin's. In terms of uh, wagons, what we have, we have, well, these two for oil, crude oil. And then we have these two for, how is this called? It's not even telling us. What? <laughs> yeah, so the game introduces new stuff without even telling you what it is. Great. Okay, we'll call it fuel. And then we have these two types of wagons for goods. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna pause the game for some time and I'm gonna pause the recording and figure out which would be the best you know, routes to create concerning you know, fuel production. So I'll be back soon. Uh, now my problem is that I don't know what is the correct ratio between oil wells and refineries. So we'll have to find out. So I found these two oil wells that are not very far from this refinery and the refinery itself is not very far away from this factory. Okay. And this factory will get us those tokens and some goods. And I have at least three cities not far away from this factory that requires uh, goods. So I was thinking, because I know if I were to connect these cities to transport passengers, they'll grow very fast. But I would like to do an experiment and actually find out how fast the, fast the cities will grow uh, if I'm going to deliver them goods. Because, yeah, otherwise, if you don't transport your goods from your factory, uh, they're just lost. So yeah, you you might as well transport them because you, you cannot you know sell them directly. You have to transport them to the city. And actually, they don't give you that much money when you sell them to the city. Their their main uh, point in this game, as far as I understand, is that they uh, increase cities. You know, um, just like transporting passengers and delivering mail. So. Without further ado, let's start the game in normal speed and think how we would create our stations. Oh, and we have one type, of, one new type of station, the high speed rail, which for us it's useless because we don't have uh, high speed trains because we cannot afford them. So yeah, we'll just use the old type of rail. So, and I don't want, this time I don't want to mix the oil lines and the fuel line. So I would make a line for oil, which will come somewhere 
I don't know, here. Let's see if... Because I need to leave it some space, right? At least one tile. No, I need the station. So, put it like... Okay, station track piece. Hmm. But like so, it will work. You cannot climb station. Yeah, you cannot climb station, but why don't you grow it? Okay. So I'll do it myself. Uh, like so. Yeah. And like so. It's totally unnecessary, but I'm gonna do it. Oh. Hmm. But if I... Yeah, I can build it from here to leave it more more uh, space. So I would flatten this more. Okay. And I'll build the station like from here. Yes, six tiles. And it's gonna go like this, right? So, hmm. Can I flatten this? Some of it. Okay, I can. It's more expensive, but I can. So, it's gonna be like this. And here, we're gonna build the stations. Hmm. How should I do it? Should I make it round? Like so, because it's definitely nicer when it's round. Yeah, I will do it like this. Maybe it's not the most efficient, but it's just nicer. Okay, cannot climb station, right. Okay, like this, it will come Okay, it can come like this. Yeah. Is it six tiles? It is. And then... Not enough space. For what? Here, we should not forget to leave it a way of bypassing. No. Like so. Hmm. The, definitely not the best design. Okay, here also we'll have to give it a way to bypass this station, and it's not working like this, it will work like this. Now that is much nicer than this, yeah. Now this will come something like this, but not like that. Like this. And this will come like this. Not like that. Yeah, it might work like that. Except that I probably should have built two in parallel. Yeah, my bad. So I need two stations least no I won't be able to do this mm -hmm. okay 
yeah again not the best design here This is not connected. Yeah, but unfortunately we'll have to finish this in next episode because now we're out of time and we already exceeded what we are allowed to. So as usual guys, thank you all for watching. Tell me, please tell me in the comments what we would like us to achieve in this series, what we would like me to build more or focus more, what did you like, what did you didn't like. So as usual, thank you all for watching, I hope to see you all next time and I wish you all a great day. Bye bye!